In this video, we'll find the molar mass for FeSO4 7H2O, that's iron 2 sulfate heptahydrate. We look up iron on the periodic table, that's 55.85 grams per mole. And I won't write grams per mole until the end here, it gets a little tedious. Plus sulfur, 32.07 grams per mole. Oxygen is 16.00 grams per mole. We have four oxygen, so let's multiply that by four. And then this 7H2O, it's a little bit odd. We don't see that so often in chemical formulas. That means that there are seven individual H2O molecules around this iron 2 sulfate. So we'll say plus seven times hydrogen is 1.01 grams per mole. We have two of them, so let's put that in parentheses and multiply it by two, plus our oxygen 16.00 grams per mole. So now we need to add all of these up to find our final molar mass for FeSO4-7H2O. When I add these numbers up here, I'll end up with 151.92 grams per mole. And then we'll add to that the seven water molecules. So we have 1.01 times 2, that's 2.02 plus 16. So we have 7 times 18.02 grams per mole. And 18.02, that's how much one water molecule weighs. Do that, and our final molar mass is 278.06. And we need to write our grams per mole here. Your value may be a little bit different after the decimal point. My periodic table rounds to two decimal places, so there may be a little bit of difference. But either way, this is the molar mass for iron 2 sulfate hepahydrate. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.